are making our ant farm and I'm really excited and I'm on a little bit of a adrenaline rush because um, we dug up an ant hill and I was able to get the queen and I was really excited about that. So I don't have that on video, but what we did is um, the kids and I went out hunting in the yard and we found some ants and we followed them back to where their ant hill was. Well, and we just um, dug into the um, ground where the ant hill was to pull up the ants and then we scooped them into a bucket um, or a glass jar. And um, we were actually going to get some more because they didn't get, really didn't get enough. but. Um, I will show you what we have so far in our little temporary glass container. Alright, so here is what we have so far. We actually have a decent amount in there, but we're wanting to try to get about 50. So we are going to go back out and get a few more. And then I will show you, instead of going out to dig with the shovel like I did originally, um, because we dug up their colony, they're a little angry. <laughs> so I will show you what we're going to do to catch some more. Okay, so what we're going to do is take a piece of bread. Nobody likes the heel. So we're taking the heel and we're going to put um, some water and some sugar on this plate. And we're gonna do sugar water and then um, we're gonna dip our bread in the sugar water and then we're gonna take the bread out to the ants and try to get some more so that we can have about 50 to 80 in our container. All right, so this is our ant hill that we dug out and you can see the ants are going kind of crazy um, and I don't want to try to catch any more like this so we are gonna put we'll put our piece of bread right here close to them and then we will see we have a kitty <laughs> kitty coming to check out what we're doing um, we will leave this bread here for a little bit and see if we can get some ants on the bread and then um, once the ants are there on the bread, we'll just carefully pick up the bread with gloves or tongs and then drop it into um, another container. And then we'll put them all together, or flippers, Tyler says. Um, and then we'll put them all together in the same container once we make our little um, habitat. There's bread. I'm gonna pick it up with these. And I we don't see any ants on this, but there might be ants on the bottom. So Okay. Here we go. Peace with ants. Oh! Oh! oh Liz, you dropped them all off. Sorry. Hurry, put it in. Get in. Push it in. I'm trying to. There, there we go. go. Pro tip, cut towards your buddy, not your body. <laughs> okay, what are we doing next, Hayden, with this black paper? We're gonna cover it on this, so, so the ants think they're still underground. Okay, let's do it. Okay, uh, Are you need... gonna help Daddy put the tape on? Probably. Let me make two pieces of tape. Things. And we're gonna stick these on the bottom and 
it on to that. Why are we putting this hockey stuff in there? Oh, cause, um, cause we are gonna put the ants in here. No, 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 not in there. Out here. We're then, gonna okay. put the ants out here, and then, and, and that's why we put the hockey stuff so they know. So the middle doesn't move around? Yeah, so the middle doesn't move around in squishy kids. Okay, so what is it time for now? It's time! Okay, what are we doing now? So we're scooping it and then we're going to put it right here and we'll slide it here. Okay. Daddy. Oh, oh, oh. No, 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 There are ants in there, then what do you do? Um, now we're gonna put on this top. Why are we putting the top on, Hayden? So they... Hayden, why are we putting the top on? So, we put on the top in there, so that if so you get out, you put all this, I'm pretty sure that we still need it. We put the top on so they don't get out, right? Yeah. And why do we poke holes? Because they need to breathe, and we're making an egg farm. Because <laughs> they need to breathe, and we're making an ant farm. And then, after you poke holes, when you're not looking at your ants, what do you put on? A bag. A bag or a dark plastic bag. Why do you put that on? So then they think they're on the ground. Good, so they'll move around more, right? No, so I will. <laughs> <laughs> what do you say? And it's little little. With oh. a puppet. I give the ants some water. You're gonna take a cotton ball, dip in water, and put it in there every day so they can get drinking water. And you can either give them uh, fruits or bread or breadcrumbs dipped in sugar water in there for food every one to two days. And a teaspoon is good for 20 to 30 ants. Now your art farm is complete. Um, make sure not to move it a lot or else the tunnels will collapse.